Melbourne researchers are revolutionising the way radiation therapy is delivered to people fighting head, neck and lung cancers. Laying them down adds further discomfort, so they've invented a chair that could change how treatment is provided worldwide. Five years ago, Laura Winter noticed an ulcer under her tongue, but within weeks she discovered it was something much more sinister. After a biopsy, found out that it was stage four um, base of tongue cancer. Two thirds of her tongue was removed and the floor of her mouth was replaced with skin from her wrist. The mother of two then underwent radiation therapy five days a week for six weeks. I had quite extensive burns on the outside, blistered in, and, and inside my mouth as well. Laying down for treatment was torture. No, it's a time to burn in from the inside out. But Melbourne researchers have invented a chair that could help to take away patients' pain. And instead of rotating a heavy machine around a patient, we, we rotate the patient instead. They'll spend three years finessing the chair and treating patients in it. Towards the end of the year, we hope to, to take the first 3D images of patients with this. The project is being funded by the Cancer Council. We really want to make sure that we're continuing to invest in the people that are changing the face of cancer into the future. Not only was the idea born here, but the chair itself was constructed at the Peter McCallum Cancer Centre, utilising its engineering department, while the seat was taken from a boat because of its ability to swivel. We do a lot of manufacturing in-house, which really helps us to customise these devices. 42-year-old Laura is now cancer-free, but she hopes this invention encourages patients to persevere with their treatment. Something so seemingly simple is amazing. It would change um, so many people's lives. Candace Wyatt for 10 News First.